Here we are, some of the new products featured on this opening little table here. Another tablet carrier. Really good quality. Luggage. And of course they always have nice cool hats that you can sport and walk around with. I got a few of them myself. Rapid Assault shirt. You have the in the storm color, which is uh, my new favorite color here. It also has in the in the green and the multi cam. Of course. They have it, uh, what is this, the sandstone color? Oh, khaki, it's the khaki. Blue and also black. So, rapid assault, true to size. Come check it out. Here we have the sleeved and the sleeveless holster shirts. I have the sleeved, I love it. I'm gonna have to pick up a sleeveless as well. But it really hides it. I normally will have a, a Glock 27. I can even fit a Glock 23 in it pretty comfortably. And I just put it in one pouch here on the side. I'll have a more in-depth review on this later. But uh, very good quality and they have a big selection here. So whatever color, uh, sleeved or no sleeved, they got it. Here's the rack where they have the Tac Light Pro Short. They have the 11 inch, which is a new popular and new favorite. All different colors, we got coyote, khaki, black, tundra. Check out the tundra. It's probably one of the coolest colors here. And we have the vest. The strike pant. We have all sizes here. We have the Tac Light Pro pant sizes and colors all the way down TDU and the belts can't say enough about the belts all different types of belts no matter if you're at work or you're an actual operator you're at work in business they have a belt for you and some nice business looking belts. Great materials. And if you're like my father, you still like the basket weave. I like the basket weave too. Have real sturdy belts here. 1.5 inch width and 1.75 inch widths. Uh, very good. They even have a special line you know from SHOT Show with women's gear. Always be ready. So here we have a whole rack of women's gear. Not sure of your size. They have fitting rooms here, so come check it out. Here are some of the popular boots that 5.11 has. And the socks, if you've tried on the 511 socks, you know that you don't wear other socks. You keep coming back and you get new socks here. We have the uh, Pursuit shoes, the laced and the no laced shoes. Nice and storm. For all the officers out here, here's the full line of duty gear. Has all your little holsters and pouches. Basket weave style and regular nylon style. Or if you work security too, same thing. Here we have two popular belts. We have the Maverick Assault belt here. nice quality that latches very nicely and this is just real tough I'm squeezing the edges here and it will not collapse in nice strong sturdy uh, 
fucking loop Velcro. And we have the Brocos VTAC belt. This is part of the Kyle Lamb series, I believe. Um, I don't have one of these uh, yet, but it uh, has this nice webbing. Uh, it's pretty comfortable and it's, uh, it really airs out, I can imagine, here. But, uh, it's nice, has a Velcro. You can add more attachments here. You can attach your holster. Has all the molly that you can want, ever want. You got the black and the sandstone color. Of course, you have your, all your boonie caps, whatever you want. Black, the green, and the uh, multi cam, of course. Any of the 511 videos, they got them all here. Sometimes they're even playing here in the store, so you can get a sneak peek of what's in there. Here's some more belts here. Here's a lot of your attachments that you'll want to have. Then you attach on to any molly on any of the bags that we'll look at in a second or on the Brocos belt. <laughs> gloves, all the gloves. Uh, sometimes you don't know which ones to order, uh, but you can try them on here. And they're true to size from any other gloves that you may have had. Check them out. Nice t-shirts, good, qu good quality t-shirts. Now, this area, all the bags, range bags, rifle bags. If you're like me, you love bags. These are the highest quality bags the Covert M4 Shorty. Right. Single rifle bags, double rifle bags. If you go to the office and you're the type that carries a messenger bag, they have different sizes. Really neat quality here. Check out this messenger bag here real heavy duty strap of course we got that uh, shoulder webbing here it's nice and airs out it's modular so you can unstrap it here and move it to the other side or you can remove it all together. Here you have your Velcro, so you can attach that the 511 uh, pistol holster to it. And this can all secure down with this Velcro strap. Very nice quality. And, and padded. And padded in there. All kinds of pockets here. You can put anything that you want office supplies, medical supplies, or snacks. So, put this strap back in here, keep it over. And even Velcros, you don't even have to, you want quick access, you don't even have to hook these together. Just quick right in here, and back out. Right on this area here, has the laser cut molly. That's the, the new thing. Uh, uh, it doesn't scream tactical on this one, so if you like that, you can still take this to the office and be nice and professional. You can also put your any patch here. 511 has the patch of the month. Each month they have a new patch. You can just put those here. Maybe what I'll do is get a bag and put every patch of, every patch of the month for the year 2015 all in one bag. Back here, there's another little Velcro loop. You attach stuff to, of course, another compartment. You didn't think that was all the compartments in this bag. Another place to to put a gun. Another little holster uh, pouch here. So, with the double YYK zipper, 
So whichever way you want to access it, you're good. So the cameraman can kind of pan out all the new bags. I mean, this one, you can send your kids to school with this bag and uh, no one's going to say tactical. Real nice padding here. Oh, that really is nice and padded. Um, here's one of the larger messenger bags. I think this one's the x-ray. Has the same features as that one, but more pockets and larger, so if you carry uh, larger things, like x-ray, uh, that would be good. <clears throat> Here we have the Moab 10 bag. I'll be doing a deeper review on the Moab 10 uh, and the multi-cam, uh, but they have them now in the, in the storm color. Just kind of get a view of the different bags. Here we have the TAC light plate carrier. This one's in black, obviously. You can move things around. Let's just get a little quick view of it. Very nice. And then here's one of my favorites. This is the, uh, the TAC Tech plate carrier. I had to look at it just so I didn't get tongue twisted. And they're even making the, the side portion of this so you can remove this and put the other side in there. Really neat features on this, such as the pull-out handle in the rear. Rip that out. You can drag your buddy out of danger. Really is cool. It's a cool feature. Plus it detaches here. So if you need a quick release, it's got it. Quick release. You can see one of the cables here. I'll put that back in here in a second. And then here, <clears throat> we have the LBE vest. So pretty much, they got everything here. Even your large luggage, real high quality, very sturdy. These wheels are very sturdy here. And this luggage comes up to just past my waist when it's standing tall. So that really is a tall one. That's a little bit smaller. You're the type that doesn't want to take a, a camouflage or a sandstone color or a green bag to the gym and you got this right here really nice color scheme here you got the gray integrates this other kind of a beige color with the orange and here it is just on a normal guy you would never think that that's uh, some kind of tactical gear very covert Nice sweatshirts. I have two, two of the sweatshirts here. Here's some other bags. These are uh, carry-on types right here. Just to give you an idea of these suitcases compared to the larger. And there's even the larger one that we were just looking at. few different size of uh, duffel bags here. I'll be able to give a more in-depth review on, a, on one or two of these in the future. This wouldn't be a complete video if I didn't show you the items in this case. Watches. And some different knives. If you thought that was all the knives, you're wrong. A lot more knives right through here. Just a quick look. You know, to go to the website and you can see everything they have in detail and up close.
I carry the uh, Alpha Scout Tanto knife everywhere I go. Quick view of the sunglasses. Some of the duty lights and cuffs. And of course, pens. You guys are outside working. Uh, of course, you're working in rainy conditions as well. You're going to need a pen. You're filling out reports, a pen that works in the rain. You have your nice assortment here called Right in the Rain. And notepads. Here we go. Look at this. This has been getting rained on for months now. And the paper is still not tearing or ripping. So if you're filling out little reports and notes and doing field interviews out there, really you can't afford to not have some type of uh, notebook that's weather resistant or even waterproof like this stuff here. So. And I know it's been going on for months because it's been a long time and I've seen this still going and going. I mean, just feel that. I can even tug on it a little bit. It's not ripping. That's great. All right. And we got more sweatshirts. Places to put patches of the month. More uh, Tac Light TDU shirts. I have the one in the khaki. Uh, still feels like brand new every time I wear it. Hasn't shown any signs of wear and tear at all. Vests. I want you to notice something about these vests. They're longer than your traditional vest uh, and for a good reason. This is just long enough to cover up your sidearm. So if you want to wear your sidearm with it outside the waistband holster, tuck in your shirt and throw this vest on for a quick trip to the store uh, in the middle of the night to get some snacks, then uh, this is the vest that you want because it'll still conceal your sidearm and even with an outside waistband holster, you can't beat that. So this sweatshirt here, uh, more appropriately called the Diablo hoodie, I uh, want to point something out. It has these pockets. If you can see in here, it has a zipper on the inside. If you unzip it, it has these pockets. So you put your hands in your pockets like you would with any other regular hoodie. But say you have your hands in here and you quickly you need to want you want to access your firearm well what do you do I mean you pull it out here and you lift up here or if you if you're alert you can unzip this little side pocket there and that gives you access right here to the inside to your to your belt or your shirt so you can just have your hands in here you can literally have your hand on your weapon maybe appendix carry or something like that and you have access to it boom there you go pretty cool feature uh, on, on this hoodie so it's pretty comfortable material it's fleece lined or this material is very soft if you can see that get my cameraman in here pretty neat yeah, good colors too. Good patches. Look at this. Real nice colors. So, you know, even school colors, professional team colors. So, very nice. Here are some of the Recon Vandal short. I'll do a review on these more in depth. But the different colors they have. Check it out. One of my favorites, the storm color. Of course, they have the charcoal. 
and the Coyote Brown. I have the pear and the Coyote Brown. They are great. Very comfy, very stretchy and lightweight. Some of your covert shirts. And here I am, trying on the pants. Got my backpack on. No, that's not me. <laughs>